Hey guys, welcome back. In my part one video, I have explained about how you could approach any ideatom problem statement. Please watch it. If you not yet watched, uh, watch. In this video, I will talk about my experience of clearing Cisco ideathon round. Firstly, to the people who don't know Cisco ideathon, Cisco annually conducts placement drive to all the NetAcad partnered colleges across India to recruit a network consulting engineers. One of the key rounds during selection process is Cisco ideathon round. Three problem statements were given to us, uh, out of which we have to choose one and develop a solution uh, for that problem statement. The problem statement given to me is sh shown above. Use connected technology to solve business problems seen in unorganized sectors. Take any unorganized sector and find a technological solution to help the industry during a uncertain or pandemic like situation. Now I read the problem statement thoroughly until I understand the theme of the problem statement. So I understood the theme, it, uh, theme is in any pandemic situation, one of the most affected uh, sector is unorganized sector. So we need to develop a solution to this unorganized sectors. Then I removed all the unnecessary wordings from the problem statement and obtained a problem statement number two. In the problem statement number two, uh, I remain with uh, word, wordings like connected technology, solve business problems, unorganized sectors, technological pro solution, uh, uncertain or pandemic like situation. So from these problem statement, now I did research on each of them thoroughly and got to know about them in depth. Then I came to know that unorganized sector is main concern here. So I surfed across internet and listed out all the possible unorganized sectors. Nearly I listed 40 unorganized sectors and from these 40 unorganized sectors in the first pass of elimination, I removed all the areas where there, uh, there is a decent solution already existed. Uh, now I left with 15 of them. Uh, for these 15 of 15, I need to make second pass. In the second pass, I eliminated based on guessing whether there is a chance or not to choose this area by large audience. Then I remained with three and once I looked into my necessities among the three, uh, one is Barber. Uh, that time because it is, it is, it's been long time I get haircut then so I have chosen Barber and designed a solution of making him to come to my home to do haircut. Now that I have a solution in my hand, I need to present it very neat and clear to the judges. So I used very good filming techniques and editing skills to make it more reachable. Uh, it is more important step like we cook food and if we don't serve it properly, then the pain of cooking goes in vain. On top of everything that we discussed till now, I will give you three main key points uh, in acing any ideathon. Never think in air to get an idea. Put everything that you uh, that you think on the paper. The second one is know the theme of the problem statement very pinpointedly. And the third one is present it very neat and clear to the judges. That's it. This is all about my Cisco Ideathon clearance experience. Hope it definitely helps you in acing any Ideathon. <laughs>